some respects, we were guinea pigs just try to find out how to make this thing. So they had a series, as far as you surmised, they had a series of different scientists try to back engineer this thing, try to figure out what this thing was, and they would bring in new people and like, let's throw Bob at it. Yeah, yeah. And they know, I know I don't know how many, but I knew there was certainly one before me. And I now, you can't see Bob's story in the correct light after 30 years. And at some point, we should just touch upon that. Um, the the biggest being that things like the Tic Tac UFO case that that came out. I've heard people even on the show say, "Oh, there's a glitch in the radar." You, that's a data vehicles. People are getting the acronyms wrong. So the the reason for the terminology change is so that we can mimic what we're reading in the DIA documents. People can look for that now. So they changed the names to get people away from UFO or UAP, even like Hillary Clinton said on air, right? So What are you talking about? If you examine all the information that you've said today, if you, you look at all the things that the detractors have said, if you look at all of the new recent evidence that's coming out and all these really high-level people in the military and the government that are discussing this, it gives you far more credibility than you would have had in the 1980s sure. when this came out. Fuck yes, sure. you can't ignore his world. story just because you don't like it anymore. That's why I thought it was important that you come out and refresh the world's memory and let people know. And like I said, I've been, I, mean, I don't want to say I'm a fan of yours, but I guess I'm a fan of yours. As a human being, I'm a fan of yours.